Llewellyn finds room, tries to step back three, connects. Jalen Llewellyn. Bulldogs, Austin Williams replaces Paul Atkinson underneath. One of three seniors on this team for the Bulldogs, so he gets a spot in the starting lineup. Near side for Llewellyn. Llewellyn picking his way to the lane. Turns right, beautiful layup by Jalen Llewellyn. Numbers for Llewellyn. Goes to the other side of the floor with Freiburg and gets it right back. Handoff from Ariri Guzzo, a spin for Llewellyn and a beautiful finish. Great spin. Llewellyn all the way in and the foul. Three point play out. Ariri Guzzo, but it's 6'11, 205, maybe just not the strength to compete down there. Jalen Llewellyn inside the. It really does, and I think it took him a little while here at Yale to find his role and, and figure out where he kind of fits in, and he's definitely found it. I mean, last night was just amazing how he came through. And even though tonight is senior night, the entire two-game span is senior weekend. And with the way Yale played last night, there is no reason to be disappointed. There's Llewellyn inside, gets by well up the floor with Hunsaker. And Anderson trailing him, goes up and under for two. Gets around both. This isn't doing a nice job defensively. Quick trigger. Freiburg has 10 points. And yeah, Juzang was cutting through the lane, didn't see him. Second giveaway by Harvard in this game. 9-7 the lead for Princeton. Tigers on the drive. Spin along the score. Outside players along the wings need to do a little bit of a better job of getting open once Lewis gets caught down low. Ah, Llewellyn hits his minutes to go here in the first half. Well, that's why you want to use that backboard when you're going so fast. It's almost like a sponge. It absorbs any mistakes. Points for McBride. 12th time he's been in double figures. Llewellyn quickly coming down the floor, spinning into the paint. Go you know, where did he go? Kentucky? And then you did, you hadn't heard of the school. And it, it seems like you just do everything on that. Jay Broder. Goodman with five for the Quakers. Llewellyn all the way into the rim. The Freiburg. Out to Llewellyn. Another three. That's good again. Jalen Llewellyn. I mean, that's I'm still playing this basketball game. Morales, left-handed dribble. Fumbled it for a moment. Finds Schwieger. Now into the corner. Llewellyn, three. Got it. Jalen Llewellyn. On the offensive end. Due to open looks that just couldn't climb in over the rim. There's the backdoor. Princeton offense went to perfection. Win against Harvard since March of 2017. Llewellyn, scoop shot is good. Here's Llewellyn. Riri Guza comes on the right side. Here right was the one made the basket. Llewellyn, that's a tough that, make. That's got Llewellyn, got it! Feeling good about yourself and the way you played your final week. I gotta get Ganey back in, which he is. Where he goes, though, hands back off to Llewellyn, who drives the floater in the paint, drops in. Another bounce there. Now Freiburg to right, Llewellyn and Schwieger. Riri Guzzo gets a touch. Everybody will. Instead, Llewellyn wants it himself. Pass gets knocked away, but right is on the spot. Shot clock under 10. Llewellyn, corner three. Give it to him. Defense has been. And we've talked a lot about the offense of the Bears struggling, but part of that, and a big part of that, has been the stifling Princeton defense. Bears continuing to come away with empty possessions as Llewellyn slips it up off the glass and in. Number 20. And that goes. Wow. Are you a pretty athletic kid. He can also use his length uh, if, if a smaller defender gets by him. Just has not been able to get it going here as of late. Llewellyn, a Riri Guzzo with the dunk. Hi. And it's good to see some of the uh, big guys getting in the post now. Instead of just a guard. Yeah, that's something as, as we keep talking about. Something to watch because if you're a Cornell fan, you don't want Princeton scoring with a shot. With Dartmouth has cut it down to four. Starters on the floor for the Tigers. Here's Llewellyn, right-handed off the glass, tough angle. The season against Iona. You see there where he can be so effective. Screens down for Llewellyn. Great shooters have to be great screeners. There's a triple from J. Fellow Anthony action. And a steal. Llewellyn down the floor and lays it in. Every game, he's been a nice revelation for Steve Donahue's side.
Funny man, if you were to look at him and Dev Goodman, Goodman and be like, one's a senior, one's a freshman, you probably wouldn't think Dingle is the freshman because he doesn't play like it, he doesn't look like it. Llewellyn over Goodman. Llewellyn, top of the key to the foul line. Outside DeRosier, three, that's good. Jerome DeRosier. Game 53rd of his career, and that Jerome one timely, Jerome. and it's one of the rare times we've been able to Game, he has six so far. Llewellyn down low, lays it in, to end the drought. Llewellyn. He's had a quiet second half. He has not scored here offensively. Had 10 in the first half. Seven to shoot. Down to five. Llewellyn to the rack. Banks it in. Schwiger. Double teamed in the paint. Peels off. Good defense by Broder. Five to shoot. Llewellyn. Got it. And Williams, the three seniors. Llewellyn inside. The left-handed finish. 19 points. 13 in the high off the glass. Knocked back up and in by Llewellyn. Who's uh, over on the right side of Freiburg. Gardner's getting out on the shooters here. Not giving Princeton that three opportunity. Llewellyn makes one. He's a game up. Uh, he's made a couple of by saying tough and that's what Princeton's been giving up is those tough twos. We've seen a lot around the top of the key area. Llewellyn all the way in, lays it up and in. Here this evening, the runs for the Bears have been extremely limited. Seven to shoot. Schwiger going at Huntsaker. Outside, Llewellyn for three. Knocks it down. And it's Llewellyn with the rebound. Down the floor for a Walmart. And Walmart, you're on step right at the yeah. shot. Jerome DeRossier. Morales gets a step. Not to Llewellyn. He'll launch a three and hit. Jalen Llewellyn hits a three. Two, still plenty of time to get back in the top four race. And it's good to have upperclassmen to do that. Schwager cutting to the basket. The way that is the antithesis of what the Quakers do, frankly. And so they don't see it quite as much. But when you got players... Ariri Guzzo. Llewellyn inside. He is so crafty around the hoop. And now he'll get his chance for an and one. 